Hi and welcome to my video blog about uh, the chemo treatment number 7, 8 and today will be my ninth. Uh, so today so far I am at the hospital right now um, and also I did my blood test, I saw my doctor so now I'm waiting for my blood result uh, to know my numbers and also I am uh, waiting uh, to receive the chemo treatment. So uh, the only updates that I have so far, so at chemo number 7, my numbers from my last video was number 19. So number 7, it was down to 14, so it dropped by 5. And then last week at chemo number 8, it dropped by 1 only, so my numbers was 13. So I can't wait to know the number today, how much it will drop. Unfortunately, it's not dropping as fast as the doctor would have hoped, but at least it's dropping. Um, so that's basically it. Also, I asked the doctor today, um, I wanted to know what he was actually testing uh, in my blood because I always filled out about three tubes and last week he filled four tubes. So he said every week what he verify is uh, the kidney because the chemotherapy could actually affect the kidney so as to make sure that everything's still healthy and everything and also the bone marrow. So for me, so far, so good. Uh, everything's still perfect and intact, so thank God for that. And hopefully it's going to stay that way. And the third thing that he's verifying each and every week as well is um, uh, the level in the blood. So uh, to see how the cancer uh, is, right? So the, the update on the cancer, basically. So that's pretty much my updates for this week. I will do another blog probably in two, three weeks time. Uh, unfortunately, I'm having much more treatments that we were hoping for. Um, but once again, my number went higher than we probably thought as well. So, uh, but it is what it is. We do what we gotta do. Uh, as for the pain, the pain is, um, almost absent I'm still having some back pain but it's more in the higher level of my back so shoulder arm things like that uh, the nausea is still there the headache is still there and the fatigue is still there uh, my fatigue is not as strong as it was I don't have to sleep all morning all afternoon and all night long like it was but I definitely do need to sleep during the day still um, I do need some rest so um, and also the fitting might have been that it's probably better as well. Uh, my, my bleeding stopped and now it's a week that it's top. However, it could start back any time that the doctor told me. And, um, and also I have help at home, so it helps a lot. But, um, but yeah, so that's basically it. If you have any concern, comments, any question, don't hesitate to post them and I'll be happy to try to head to them as best as I can. And um, I wish you good luck and uh, keep being positive. It's not easy and I know that, um, but we got to. All right, so take good care. Bye-bye.